Hi, this is Deb Sukovic with Dual Dot Media. Today I'm going to show you how to airbrush in Photoshop. Here's our finished piece, and we're going to start from scratch. We're going to use a 250 by 250 area with 300 dpi pixels on just a plain white background. The first thing we're going to do is start off with guides. Guides are very important. It gives you a better understanding of where you are on your piece. So we're going to start off with a 50% vertical guide and a 25% horizontal. Now arrows can be done in a multitude of ways, but for today's purposes we're going to use just the line, the line tool with black for color on 10 pixels. And we're going to use snap to guides because it's going to give us a nice straight line. So hold your shift key down, start at the top, just pull it down to the bottom. And you can see we're on a straight, it gave, gave us a straight shape. And we're going to go on a new layer. We're going to take a diagonal and again, we're using our shift key and we're going to pull it down diagonally. Not quite a half. Now, you can do the same on the other side, but to make life easier for you, just go in, duplicate your layer to edit, and then, and all you need to do is flip horizontally. And you have the same exact duplication on that other side. What you should do at this point is merge those three layers But, oh, I see a mistake. My straight arrow, see where I have my arrow pointing? The straight line is just peeking out on the right-hand side. So Photoshop is great. We're going to do an undo merge layers. And we're going to go to that very bottom layer. And we're going to just pull it down just a hair, not even a pixel. And it's done. We're going to go back into the layers and we're going to merge those layers. We're going to go over to layer style and we're going to take it a step further and we're going to bevel the arrow. And you can play around with this. There's lots of different combinations. Uh, there's lots of resources. You can go out and you can get pre-made styles and do different things. But we're going to just kind of play around here a little bit. But I think I like the first one we had. Gives it a little bit of depth. We're going to take our guides off, clear our guides, and there's our arrow.